Hello guys, I'm going to show you how to implement authentication in React.js. I'm going to use a service called Auth0 in order to implement authentication because it's really easy to use. If you create an account and sign up to Auth0 and go to Docs tab, you will see this page, which is the first step to get started. And you can see that there are a couple of choices here. You need to choose a single app in this case, and then your technology which is React in my case. You can choose whatever framework you're using. And here, click on create a new app. Give your app a name, for example, my app, creative. Hit save. And then here, as the URLs, you need to copy the URL your app being hosted on, which is a local host of 3000 in my case, which is a React app paste and save all of them. And the next step is just uh, following the guides here, which is really straightforward. At first, we need to install Auth0 using this command, copy it and go to your app. Open your terminal and on the new window, paste it. Hit enter and wait until it is completely installed. All right, clear your terminal. and go to this tab index.js we need to add this auth0 provider tag inside our app.js so copy it from the starting until the closing auth0 provider tag and go to your index.js okay and here paste whatever you copied all right inside the strict mode tag remove the app tag and then take the starting tag of the strict mode and put it on the top okay it's going to wrap everything so we need to put auth0 inside strict great and the last thing inside index.js is to import auth0 provider auth0 provider which is this one yeah great save the changes and close index.js we're done with it Go to your browser and the next step is to implement our login component. Go to login.js tab and as you can see, there's a component. Copy whatever it is. And inside your components directory, inside source, create a new file called authlogin.jsx or js, doesn't really matter. Paste whatever you copied. Mm -hmm. And I want to change the function name to auth login instead of login button. You can leave it as the way it is, doesn't really matter. Auth login and then export default this auth login. Save the changes and go to your app.js and put a tag of auth login inside your fragments. Great. Save the changes and let's run our app and take a look. Okay, as you can see, there's a login button here. And if I click on it, I'll be redirected into the login page of Auth0. And if I enter my information and accept authorization, I'll be redirected to the first page, as you can see, but I'm logged in actually. I'm redirected because there's a redirect URI to the location origin here. That's why we are redirected to where we started. And the next step, let's uh, actually admit that we logged in. Let's go to profile.js, uh, this tab, and copy the code. Go back to the app and create a new file. Let's call it authprofile.jsx or js. Paste the code. And let me change the name of the function to authprofile. and then expert default auth profile. Okay, save it and add a tag of auth profile to your app.js. This will show your profile on the main page and you can see that you are actually logged in. Open your app and as you can see, this is the auth0 default profile with email and profile picture and yeah. 
So we're actually logged in. Let's go and implement a logout as well, which is here. And OK, let's copy the code. Go back to your app and create a new file. Let's call it off logout.jsx. Again, doesn't really matter JSX or JS. Paste everything and let me change the function names to off logout instead of logout button. Export default off logout. Save the changes and add a tag of off logout inside your app.js. Don't forget to import all these guys after using them or maybe before using them. Off logout. All right, save the changes and let's take a look. Now I'm logged in. If I click on logout, you can see that my profile is not here anymore, which means I have logged out. And that's pretty easy. And we're actually done with the authentication with Auth0. And you can customize it in your own way. And that's all. Thanks for watching.